Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Lori Candle and we're going to do Goose Creek Traveler Collection Candle. And this one is Fresh Baked Bread. And it's got a picture of Germany, a little Bavarian village. Love it. Um, this one I've had, I've melted a couple of times before now. And I just threw it under there to warm the top of it um, to kind of get it going so you can see it under the light. But um, I'm, I'm not melting it full pool right now. And um, the scent notes are fresh baked bread, dough, warm bread crust, slow melted butter. Okay, so I've heard different opinions about like what it smells like. Some people said it smelled like popcorn. Some people smelled, said it smelled like yeasty dough. Some people said it smelled like warm bread baking. Um, I kind of get a little bit of all of that in there. Uh, but this candle... Is not weak by any means in my opinion it's got to be at least an eight uh, in general and um, it can be a little bit much if you <clears throat> don't like the scent of yeastiness uh, it's not it, it kind of comes and goes it's really interesting because you you get the complexity of the notes where it smells like yeast but then it also smells like dough but then it also smells like baked bread um, the description is kind of redundant, I think. Fresh baked bread dough, warm bread crust, which would be like fresh baked dough, slow melted butter. Okay, I don't think that slow melted butter really smells any different than fast melted butter. I don't really get a lot of butter in it. Um, <clears throat> but, you know, they got to make it kind of peeling, I guess, when they word those things. Um, for me, I actually melted it the second time with chocolate chip cookies because it, it didn't smell like popcorn to me or anything like some people have said, but it was just kind of a note in it. There's just notes in it that are a little bit much for me after a while. And I wanted to sweeten it up a little bit, kind of put a little bit more bakery into it. Um, then to kind of hide some of the yeastiness that I didn't really like. And it actually smelled fairly decent with chocolate chip cookie. Um, it kind of just boosted the scent of the baked bread and just added a little sweetness to it, which I love the chocolate chip cookie candle, and it's got a good throw, and it's really yummy smelling. So I just wanted to add some type of stronger bakery note to the bread, kind of the yeastiness, um, but then also still kind of get that scent of the warm bread in there. Um, I'm not buying another one of these because it's not one that I prefer. But if you do like that yeasty, warm, kind of bread dough-ish scent, you would probably really love this candle. Um, it is, it's unique, I think. There's not a lot of them out there that smell like warm bread. And I think this one captures a lot of the essence of the bread dough and, and the baked bread. So, you know, I mean, this, this one is not a bad candle at all. You, it, I think it's just an acquired preference you know and so um but yeah i mean i'm glad that i got it uh i just don't feel like i need two of these uh in my stash so anyway um yeah i mean it's got a good throw and it's, it's unique it's interesting and i do love the label it is super cute i love the i mean i have german in my ancestry and i have been to leavenworth washington which is like a recreation of a bavarian village and this um, picture is just like super cute and really depicts what it looks like in Bavaria, in Germany. So anyway, I hope this is helpful to you. Like and subscribe and um, we'll see you guys again real soon for some more reviews. Thanks and have a great night. Bye-bye.